What's up, you guys? This is Mary with HPI High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Um, only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Very important. Just saying. Okay, so I received a channeling. I hope everybody's doing well. Um, I've been promoting a lot of Spiritual Advisor LLC's videos recently. Um, if you might want to check them out on the community tab for the newbies. Community tab, you've got to scroll over, click on community tab. I post photos on there. I post other readings from readers on there, i.e. Spiritual Advisor, LLC, Alicia. Uh, I, I post information on there just to let everybody know, okay? Okay, let's do it. Hope everybody's doing well. 5, 12 p.m. Central Standard Time, April 12, 2023. On a Wednesday. I'm okay. Just saying. Okay. So, the channeling I received was a masculine energy intuitively knows who the one already is. But there's two situations. So, for some of you, it could be this masculine energy that intuitively already knows who the one is. Or not. You have to plug it in how it resonates. But, there's two situations for the masculine energies that intuitively know who the one is. The one. For one situation, one, they're already with this person. So they're already in a relationship with this person in some shape, form, or fashion. That's situation one. Situation two, they are not with this person. So they are not together with this person. They're not dating them. They're not engaged. They're not married. They're not even boyfriend, girlfriend. They're not with them. But in both situations, and confirmation for my kitty. In both situations, they both know intuitively who the one is. So like twin energy is what I'm feeling. You plug in how it resonates. I feel for some of you guys, you could be the masculine energy um, that intuitively knows who the one is, whether you're already with this person in the universe, like boyfriend, girlfriend, fiance, or married spouse, or you're not with this person. How that resonates and applies. Oh my God, you can't make it up. Oh my, what? I just heard take all three. Oh my God. You cannot. You cannot make it up if you wanted to. I shuffled the cards, dude, and do that. I heard take three. I looked at three. The bottom of the deck. Divine Fem. Second card, Divine Masculine. Third card, Dynamic. Twin Dynamic. And then we have Root Chakra underneath it. And Earth. So maybe for one, your Earth sign. Or you have Earth in your chart. Force Capricorn Virgo, possibly. Oh my God, you can't make it up, man. Even if you wanted to. Divine Femme was the first card out. So, masculine energy. Divine masculine. You know intuitively who the one is for you. I.e. the twin flame dynamic. Twin flame dynamic. Of the masculine, divine, masculine, divine, fem. Now, twin dynamics can be masculine, masculine, fem, fem, too. But in this aspect, it's a, we heard it through the channelings before I even got the cards out. It was a, it was a divine, masculine, divine, fem. Just saying. Damn. I mean, you can't make this up even if you wanted to. Um, so, you know who your divine, fem is. Whether you're already with her in the universe. Fiance, spouse, dating. Um, however, girlfriend, boyfriend, whatever she is to you, or not boyfriend, but girlfriend, whatever she is to you, sir, the one already with her, your divine fam, you already know who your one is with the dynamic energy, divine masculine, or you are not with your person yet, but you know who she is, your divine fam is. With your dynamic. Oops, wrong card. With your dynamic. Just saying, just saying. I could strongly feel, at least for one of you guys, your earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Or your divine femme is an earth sign. They could, you or them could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Moon, and Heaven, Jupiter charts. Whether it's your, you or the divine masculine that has earth in your chart. Or your divine femme has earth in her chart. Just saying, just saying, with the dynamic, baby. What? You just can't. 
We have sacral chakra too with the root chakra underneath that. So that's um, feelings, that's sexual energy, that's desire, drive, motivation, root chakra, that's balance. Um, and solar plexus, yeah. Wow. All right, hold on a second. I think the twin flame dynamic for the one that's already in it, in the universe, you've already found your one, i.e. your twin. I think your divine fem gives you balance. And for the one, you know who your twin is, but you're not with them in the universe. I think you know your twin would give you balance. Just saying. What? This is so awesome. feel like doing the clueless thing. Like 16-year-olds, like, totally. Just saying. Number 21, 22, 23, or 24 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 21, 22, 23, or 24 could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. 21, 22, 23, 24. The Divine Fem is a huge balance here for the ones with this person in the universe and the one situation where they're not. She's She gives huge balance to situations. Huge balance. And he knows this. The one not with this person. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So we've got two situations. So for at least one of you Divine Masculines, you are with your lady. Sweet lady. That's what I'm thinking of. That song. Um, you're with your one, sir. But you know she gives you huge balance. You know she does. Um, and I'm sure that's why you're with her. I, I hope that's not the only reason you're with her. But I'm sure that's one of the reasons. She is like your salt to your pepper. Your, um, your, I'm not going to use that one. Your salt to your pepper, your lemon to your iced tea, your um, uh, oil to your vinegar, your ketchup to your mustard, how the, your bun to your weenie, how that resonates, okay? She is your balance, your temperance. For some, she could have a size in her chart, or you could, but she, I don't care about the signs. She gives you balance, temperance energy. For situation two, where you're not with your lady, and this aspect, it really is a femme energy, divine femme. She gives balance. I heard you many situations, but you're not with her. But somehow, she gives balance to your situation. She grounds you with the earth energy and gives balance, the temperance energy, Sag energy, to our situation. So two or two plus situations. So somehow, I feel for whoever is in this situation, she's in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. Now, however she's in your life, only you know that. She could be a co-worker. She could be a business partner. She could be, you could purvey services from her. She could be your neighbor. She could be a friend. Um, however that resonates. But she gets balanced to many situations. So two or two plus situations. She's in your life somehow. That's what I'm saying. Somehow. Of course, you plug it in how it resonates. <clears throat> Many shocking series of time events are about to occur with these situations. These bonds are about to get closer and deeper. Both situations. So both situations. Sorry. Many shocking series of chain events are about to occur. There's about to be balance. Uh, more balance. More dynamic. Balance dynamic energy I'm feeling. 
um, had in both of these situations, whether you're with your divine fam, I'm sorry, sorry, whether you're with your divine fam right now in the universe, sir, or you're not. Um, so ground, uh, like our sight energy, stability, grounding, or our balance. Well, it's actually more like temperance energy, but, um, it could ground you. I think she grounds you for a lot of you guys. I didn't hear that. Just intuitively, I feel she grounds you or keeps a level head in some shape, form, or fashion about situation or situations. I didn't hear that either. That's just intuitively what I feel. We do have the earth energy here, so I'm just saying. All right, I'm closing this out. I'm gonna go eat. Love you guys. Namaste.